What it do? Brothers of YouTube. Brother I just hit back when I be, you know what I'm saying? Boy, acting all cool and everything, you know what I'm saying? Listen, boy. In this video, we're going to talk to you guys about the truth about your NoFap journey. Now, I want you to stay tuned by the end of the video so you know what this truth is, staying laser focused, and knowing exactly what Brother Elijah is about to say. Because this is what you need during your journey of NoFap. Don't you want to go three years of NoFap? Well, I don't, nah, I don't suggest you going that long, but brother, <laughs> hopefully you get into to a relationship soon. But anyway, on a serious note, um, stay tuned by the end of the video so you know what this truth is. But until then, I'm going to be very... Now, fellas, the real truth about NoFap um, and what a lot of people don't really realize is that your boy's been doing NoFap since 2019, okay? I've been trying to succeed with NoFap since 2017. Uh, and I remember my first, my first week of actually doing NoFap. You know, I went seven days, then I relapsed. Um, and I kept going on my streak, then I kept relapsing. And the problem is, the reason why a lot of people are failing with NoFap is because they're having a strong resistance towards it, okay? NoFap should be brushing your teeth and washing your face. Everything with NoFap is about delayed gratification and also just a way of life. If you make this a challenge, then guess what's going to happen? You are causing your mindset to believe that it's only, it's only going to go a period of time until you relapse. You know, you think about a challenge. Okay, think about a challenge. A challenge only lasts for a short period of time. It doesn't last until a couple years. Okay, a challenge lasts for maybe 30 days or even 90 days. Right, maybe even a year, but I'll be very clear with you. You gotta keep in mind that you gotta hold back the resistance of it. Showing gratitude towards your NoFap journey will cause you to elevate to the next level with the journey of NoFap, okay? And this is one of the main things that a lot of people need to realize. Don't make this a challenge. Make this a lifestyle, like brushing your teeth and washing your face. When you're out there, um, you know, brushing your teeth, you're not gonna be like, um, brother, you know what I'm saying? Us, um, Let's say that you know what when God says, uh, you know, they need to go to heaven. And again, we don't know that we don't know when God, uh, you know, has for us to to leave the earth, right? But let's say that you have like ninety, you're gonna leave at age ninety, so the rapture comes then. But you know, we in the end times, brother. The end times is near. Okay, so uh, it's coming soon, brother. I just want you to realize that it is coming soon. Because he's coming like a thief in the night. Can I get an amen? Can I get an uh-oh? Stick your chest. Uh-oh. On a serious note. So let's say you're brushing your teeth. You're not going to count down from, from a thousand days. Like, you know, it's day 1,000, 999, 998. No, you're going to make this a lifestyle. It's like a common sense thing. So I want you to do that for your NoFap journey. And that's the real truth about it is that a lot of people are having resistance towards it. And it's causing them to relapse on a consistent basis. Okay, and then here's the last truth that people need to realize is that NoFap is just a tool. It's not the end all be all. You know why? Because faith that that work is dead. You can have all this energy built up inside of you. But the problem is, is that the people that are seeing non-benefits, the people that are not seeing the benefits of uh, being happy, being driven, all these things, it's because they have to have a purpose that they're working towards. Okay, you got the NoFap benefits. You got the more energy. Okay, you got to start using it. It's just like taking a pre-workout and not doing anything about it, but this time it's with your body. Pre-workout is used to, to, for uh, an enhancement of your performance inside the gym, the gymnasium, right? Try to use a big word, right? Gymnasium, okay? All right, we're about to go to the gymnasium right here. and um, Very uh, nice quality gym. The, the quality of equipment is very nice here, and uh, I think I like it very much. Uh-oh, stick your chest. Uh-oh. So when it comes down to it, man, uh, NoFap is only a tool to get you to the next level. This is a cheat code for life. The problem is the reason why people are not seeing the benefits is because they have to have a goal, okay? And also, they're focused on the female attraction. Now, female attraction will come. It's a beautiful thing. The way of life, uh, you know, the way of life, how God created men and women, the biology to have it, okay? Woman is supposed to be attracted to the man who uh, is holding his seed to produce for a child. Okay? That's exactly what the woman attraction is meant for. Right? The woman is looking for the man who's ready okay, to produce a child. Right? The man who's already strong. The man who's respecting himself. That's the beautiful thing about it. The problem is, is that 
people are too focused on the woman attraction than focusing on the purpose. The Bible says, Genesis 2, 18, it's not good for the man to be alone. Therefore, I'll provide a helper suitable for you. The Bible says helper. Okay, God did not say you're supposed to be out here, okay, looking for female attraction, right? The Bible says those who find a wife find a good thing indeed. The problem is, is that Proverbs 31.3 in the Bible, don't give your strength to women for those who are in kings. A lot of people are giving their strength to women. It's like they're, they're doing no fap, but the problem is that they're going back backwards to give their strength to the woman. And we're not called to do that. We got to be called to do the will of God. The Bible says, act like men, be strong. Let all that you do be done in love, okay? Stand firm in the faith. Act like men, be strong. Let all that you do be done in love. God is telling us to do this. We got to act like men. A man does not look, okay? A man does not go out there you know, puts his purpose on a pause to go look for, uh, you know, a female attraction, okay? That's not how it is. That's pretty much saying, you know what? The female validation is still big and it's still inside of me. We don't want that to happen. We want you to be doing it for the purpose of God, doing it for God, doing it for the uh, the will of God, doing everything that you said you set out to be. This whole NoFap journey is not just meant for female attraction, but it is meant for doing your purpose and for mainly our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Listen, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Brother, Elijah is about to be out. But listen, man, before spring break comes, I want you to achieve no fat. So if you ain't achieving no fat, brother, you trying to go on your own strength, maybe 20 days and relapse, this last day on relapse, and you still relapsing, listen, this is where you gotta humble yourself and realize that you need a humble, you need a teacher that will teach you the ways to go two plus years, three years of seat retention like it's light work. So with that being said, I want you to actually book a one-on-one -on -one consultation down below, okay, to see if you're a good fit for a warrior program. But until then, I think you know where the music go, brother. Guys, come on, Elijah. Really, you're supposed to edit it out. Hey! Oh, yeah, man, that's right. Yeah, you know what? You're supposed to edit it out. Turn up, baby. Hey. Oh. Hey. This is Eclectic Protection.